Okay, so I want to talk about the cabin mount chop. And so there's like a lot of uh, people who recommends the cabin mount relocation kit, right? Yeah. And there's the cabin mount chop, right? So let me ask you, why, why did you choose to just go with the cabin mount chop? I went with the cabin mount chop because it's basically the, the, um, the uh, bushing, everything is still at the same spot if you did a relocation at the body mount. Yeah. So that's why I just chop it because it's still in the same spot. Yes, yeah, so, and, and that, that makes more economical sense, huh? Yeah, so you're going to pay double just to have the mount move just a little bit. But the bushing, everything is still the same spot. Yeah, so, so like right here, the reason why Jerry decided just to do the cabin mount chop is because this is what he's talking about. This, this, this bolt right here with the relocation kit, basically... Everything comes to like this point right here as well. It mounts right here. And well, this, the, the, the inside of this wheel will never touch this part. Let's see if I can see this part. And so his, his way of thinking is pretty logical. All he wants is because he did some research and because the, the relocation kit just move this part right here down a little bit this way and this part right here down a little bit that way and so it makes more economical uh, choice sense to jerry just to chop this because when all it's setting down right jerry yeah. this part right here stays the same huh yeah, and yeah and so this part will never the inside of this wheel will never rub that part so it just makes more economical sense uh, in Jerry's mind, which is which is correct. Um, you don't have to remove this. You have to relocate this because at the end of the day, the relocation kit still utilizes this bolt. Yeah, that spot, huh? And so as you can see, this thing can fit 35 inch tires. And uh, where is it? Okay, so that's... Uh, uh, that's 35 by 12.5 by 17 so at the end of the day it still fits and it's not rubbing either and so um yeah so i agree with uh, jerry you don't have to have a relocation kit and after examining this here i'll show you the relocation kit only makes sense to me if you can move this if you could draw another hole right here and that's the only way it makes sense. So that everything here moves, including this hole, moves this way, where uh, it no longer has any effect on the tires. So, uh, but then the, the relocation kit that, that people uh, use, which I've installed, utilizes the same holes. So that's, um, that's some uh, smart thinking, yeah. So economical and smart. And like I said, this thing fits very, very nicely. No rubbing, no whatsoever. And again, here's what he did to it. The pinch seams, he, uh, we grinded it off first and then he started hammering it into place.